the 10-year yield. Ticking just a little bit higher, all ahead of Fed Chair Jay Powell's virtual annual Jackson Hole speech tomorrow. Joining us now, the very real move is Scott Nations of Nations Indexes here. Do you expect anything out of Fed Chair Jay Powell tomorrow that may move the bond market, Scott? Well, Sully, he said that we can expect some changes uh, in the way they think of inflation. But the problem right now, the reason that we're bumping up against 71 basis points, which is the highest level in two months, not very high, but the highest level in two months, is all about issuance. The U.S. Treasury issuing nearly $150 billion of notes here this week. We also have some in Germany and Australia. And Australia would probably be really attractive to international investors. We also have Powell tomorrow. So the way to take advantage of this, higher yields mean lower prices for treasuries. And so I want to be a seller of the September 10-year Treasury futures contract, 139.08, just above where it is right now. My target to the downside is going to be 138 even. That's halfway back to that June low. The stop, and we always trade these with a stop, 139. 24. So as you see there, we'd be risking $500 to make $1,250 at those prices. All right. Good trade there. All ahead of a big day tomorrow. Scott Nations of Nations Index is really appreciated, buddy. Thank you very much.